This is Nightly Fix. Nightly Fix. Nightly Fix. Nightly Fix. Nightly Fix. On News Talk 93 FM. It's a fix. Bono. Bono. Bono job. You heard it here first Thursdays, people. I want one more artist here. Artist that goes by the name of Jim Kelly is in the building. Welcome, sir. Blessings. Good. Everything good? Yeah, man. You uh, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. Nice, nice. Oh, what kind of music does Jim Kelly do? Um, well, originally, is music I do is, uh, I'll say, is reggae music. Reggae music. But, you know, it's a universal music. Actually, the singer that I have, um, I've, d I've done um, so far is, you know, I consider it to be, uh, you know, music where everyone can relate to. So it's not just, you know what I mean, stuck in one box. Mm. You know, but it's reggae, but it's on a broad, broad scope, you know what I mean. And of course, that's what's basically in you know, um, reggae mixed with all kinds of... A know, fusion. A fusion. A fusion. <laughs> yeah. 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 All right, Modern. so you are related to the great and mighty. Are you sir? It's sir, right? <laughs> He was it, a, yeah, he's Sir, Sir he's Jimmy Cliff. Sir Jimmy Cliff. Am I right? Respect. Yes, yes, right. I am. By how? how um, okay, so he's related with, um, on my mom's side. Mm -hmm. It's my mother's um, first cousin. Mm -hmm. So actually, when he first started out, he used to, because um, they're originally from um, sent, um, from Montego Bay, Samatan. So my mom was actually one of the first family members to move to Kingston. Mm -hmm. So, you know, when he passed for, um, I think it was Kingston College, one of those um, schools. He was st he stayed with my mom for a bit, and then you know I mean he just started doing music. So mm -hmm. you know I wasn't around them times because mm -hmm. obviously he's older than me. And then, <laughs> you know my mom would tell me the story, and then I just became fascinated with you know the stories and seeing all the records that my mom would had at, um would have at her house with mm -hmm. um the great Ken Boot and all these other people that she said it, um were his friends and. You know, I mean, it was started from there. So. You watch a movie? Yeah, watch a movie. Yeah, movie <laughs> Man can't be from there and watch a movie. All right. <laughs> All right. But I'll, I'll say I only met him like two times, though, and those, that, those times where I was small. So, yeah, so. so you know, so I was saying no collaboration in the future, no plans of collaborating. Well, you or know, step by step. Step by that step. That would be a nice rub, yeah. <laughs> that would be, yeah. That would be a nice rub right there. Yeah. But you, you are not just as... Um, uh, a singer, because I read it by on your, you managed Kaleido before he was the Kaleido, and yes, you worked with yes. um, Conscience Pinnock, before. Not, not, not Conscience, I never worked with Conscience, but I was in the, the same um, camp, around the same people. Oh, okay. That was kind of, Mark Pinnock was his yeah. manager. Okay, you know, and I, I knew Mark Pinnock. So you were a producer with, 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 with Mark um, Pinnock? Mark Pinnock, no, I used to use, um, um, you know, I'm just... They were my acquaintance, mm -hmm. you know, where I go and use a studio. So, you know, Suku would be the one who would um, build up make the rhythm straps for me mm -hmm. and stuff. You know, I used to try to produce him here and there. And, you know, I mean. So you've always been stuff. involved in music? Yeah, I've always been it. involved. So yeah. why why you decide to take this leap and say, you know what? All right. I'm going to be a singer <laughs> before I die. <laughs> yeah. The reason is that, um, you know, I've always been told that I have, like, you know, a unique voice, a nice voice, you know, and I'm a good, you know, lyricist. I can write songs and stuff, you know what I mean? And the thing is, uh, you know, I've been doing music for a while and I haven't seen um, any return. And I've been pulling so much in, so I'm like, you know what? I think I've been getting encouragement from friends and family that to start, in, you know what I mean, invest in yourself. Cause you do oh, so you've been investing in other people and you weren't yeah, getting a return, you know okay? What I mean? like, mm -hmm. In, in, in music, generally, right. you know what I mean, just mm -hmm. in music, you know what I mean, and um, so I just started to, you know, decided that, you know what, I can do it, you know mm -hmm. what I mean, because mm -hmm. I do know what it takes, and you yeah, know Yeah, you've been in the ins and the out, the in back the ins and out, yeah. you know what I mean, and I have one and two contacts, so why not just lose mm -hmm. it since, you know what I mean. I know, so you have a very artistic look, like, you look like you go to music school for years. <laughs> I, I, <laughs> well, you know what's so funny? I get it all the time, mm -hmm. all the time. And I even get the, um, the thing that um, related to one of the Marley's. Mm -hmm. And I'm going to give you a joke. Yeah, can you look? Yeah, I'm Marley. Color. <laughs> <laughs> i give you a joke. One time I was um, coming out, um, Mama Marley's, I seen sentence because they had a restaurant there. Mm -hmm. I was coming out and... You know, it's so funny that it's a tourist attraction. So people would come, um, at the tourist um, bus came when I was just walking out and they came off and they're like, oh, that's one of the mallets. 
And then, <laughs> they ran up to me. I was like, can I take your picture? And I'm like, Oh, no, yes, you should say yes. No, yes. no, Actually, tell me, on. tell me, you took advantage of it. Tell look around, I'm not Yes. <laughs> Why not? Yeah. So, <laughs> so then probably gone all over the world. I said, oh, this is one of the Mali, but... I and him check his, his name, name no. <laughs> But you're related to Instagram, our next great reggae yeah. star, yeah, so yeah, it's yeah, not a problem. So. You're, still, you're still connected to I the I hear it all the time, you know, even today. I was, when I was, I was coming in the play, I'm mm-hmm. coming down, a lady whispering on his arm. Is he, are you a, a movie star? Uh, <laughs> no, she's like, you know, I've seen some African movies before. I'm like, really? <laughs> well, no, no. <laughs> you know, also, the brown rush. It's in. I keep saying this. The brown rush. You must it's in. So, only for things you ever go for. Uh, <laughs> all right. So, you're doing a song. Um, I listened to the song on and on with Kaleido that you are you you did with Kaleido. Yeah. Talk about how that came about. Uh, you know that song, how it came about? Um, really? It's... Um, life story, and it's not only it's not only unique to me alone. It's not unique to everyone who listen it, because mm-hmm. you know on the outside you can see a person, and as you know as a notion say you know once you look good that mean everything good, mm-hmm. but really sometimes you're battling some inside conflict and True. no one knows right. True. That's why you know sometimes people commit a suicide mm-hmm. and we don't even I say yo I'm, I'm crazy, but you don't even know what someone's going through. But and then because he assumes a person are right, they not really take time off and listen. Mm-hmm. You know what I mean? So. It's it's not unique to one person, but it's a, a global thing, you True. know what I mean? And really, the next thing, how that song came about is like, every time we're in Jamaica, them see me, them say, yeah, rich yard. <laughs> Everything always cost me, triple time. I mean, I said, them don't even know it. Like, <laughs> <laughs> them don't even know say, the image is just the image. Mm-hmm. It has nothing, no um, no million dollars behind it. Mm-hmm. Well, no me I work with dollar sign from Triple Dose, the millions will might, it's gonna <laughs> come. Kind of, I'm very optimistic and yeah. positive that yeah. this song will the world. But the thing is, it's not a million, it's, it's, there's no um, big money behind Jim Kelly. It's just that you that love music, you know what I mean? And I'm willing to s- okay. now spend on my, invest on mm-hmm. myself. And I'm also, you know what I mean? So. Don't be fooled by the outside. Don't be fooled by the outside. <laughs> right. Because I do struggle. You know I, mean? I am struggling. <laughs> All right. Well, we hope that you won't struggle for long. So let people yeah. hear a little bit um, of your song. Can you sing acoustic? Jim or? Kelly, can you do something like it? Yes. Yeah, definitely. All right. So I say, um, people see my life and they think my life is great. So they look at me with envy and they try to emulate. People see my laughter. But never see my pain. People see my sunshine, but I haven't seen my rain. My happiness is great, but my sadness is the same. And if you knew the things I've been through, surely blow your brain. I could go on and on and on. I live my life throughout the star. I could go on and on and on. I could go on and on and on. I live my life throughout the storm. I could go on and on and on. So live the life you love. Love the life you live. Life is just a living. Give thanks for all my blessings. When you see my joy, you haven't seen my tears. When you see my strength, you haven't seen my fears. I could go on and on and on. I live my life throughout the storm. I could go on and on and on. Uh-uh. Uh-uh. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Kelly. Yeah. <laughs> you heard Powerful it here first Thursdays. Give it to me, baby. Yeah. Give it to me.